Hello YouTubers Since I need to make this more clear for everybody to understand what's going on with this uh, bullshit of flat earth and they attack this model which is the model used today and presented in school and all that stuff but they don't mention one thing that every rocket and every calculation they do it's based on a geocentric model but meanwhile they led you to believe that the center of the mass of this uh, so-called solar system is the Sun but meanwhile they calculate everything from the Earth this is how they calculate everything and this model was presented by Tycho Brahe a man that wasted 40 years of his life observing and having uh, an extraordinary method of calculating the meridians and all that stuff by an instrument that he developed he came to the conclusion that the model was this theater the center of mass was not the sun but it was the earth and the sun have all the other objects rotating around him except the moon the moon is rotating around the earth this uh, this uh, uh, diagram doesn't show the moon but the moon does go around the earth also so basically what flat earthers are going to attack is basically the twin brother which is this that we all know he's going to attack this but he's not going to reference the other model the twin brother basically which is the the one that is used to make all the calculations to put the rockets up there and uh, the satellites and all that stuff so that's the interesting part and the other part is also that indeed there is no experience experiment out there that proves the earth rotating even the stars only show us a procession and that procession is the celestial sphere that is processing around the earth the earth is the footstool of the so-called uh, universe so this is, is basically what uh, the flat earth and the concave earth which if you pick that model of the concave earth and revert it it's basically this model the new tyconic model which he uses to promote his concave fallacy it's based on this model and he also uses geocentric calculations but his model has a huge problem called where is it it's rotating around here it's this guy this guy has a large Jupiter and the other guy also have large trajectories and according to that model the concave earth uh, the sky the celestial sphere is very very tiny and that makes it impossible for these motions to be calculated and represented in astronomy as we see it today so this is another proof that the universe is big but not as big as they keep telling us with all those planets and all that stuff because this is only mere representation of the electric universe the magneto dielectric universe out there which creates this hologram this is an hologram that's why they go to space they don't they don't see shit remember the the Apollo moon landings and the the speech they made they were confused either they seen stars or not 
They didn't see shit. They didn't even see the moon. <laughs> so, basically, they have to make these oaks to people to make them think they are so small and we are created with higher purposes to bring order to chaos. That's our purpose here. So, Flat Earthers will only address this model and uh, will never uh, explain that this model is exactly the same as this model. And this is the correct model, which is a stationary Earth, which they also refer. They are correct on that. But it's not flat. It's round. You need at, at least 400 kilometers to see one degree arc curve in those 400 kilometers <laughs> that uh, 8 inches per mile it's balonies <laughs> you're gonna believe in masons to basically create that, that fallacy they are they were very smart and uh, unfortunately we are getting very stupid even day by day so this is the major fallacy of those uh, all those guys out there even concavert will not properly address this working model which has been proven out there this is the major problem they only fixate on this and don't say that changing the center of mass to the earth is exactly the same because all the calculations are based on this model. So that's their fallacy. Peace.